What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be frost seeding some clover and chicory, and I hope you guys follow along. So what we have here today, guys, is uh, we're overlooking about one acre of a clover chicory mix, and it is roughly middle of March, and it's a good time to frost seed. Why? Because those temperatures, what you want to look for is when the temperatures get to say about 50. Uh, about 45 to 50 something like that is a daytime high but then you're still going below freezing at nighttime so you get that thaw and freeze effect thaw freeze thaw freeze and that way the soil expands and contracts and it'll help work that seed into the soil so when it does get uh, soil temperatures around 55 58 degrees something like that the clover and chicory can start to germinate now it is actually best to do this on an existing clover field because uh, a lot of times if you're trying to do it on a new plot it's gonna be just before weeds and everything like that and you really won't get a good stand and then in the spring when everything starts to warm up those weeds will just outtake the clover and you really won't get a good germination so it's best to do frost seeding on an existing plot uh, this is a one-year-old plot almost a one-year-old plot about 10 year, 10 months old so we're gonna go ahead and frost seed this and I'll show you guys uh, how to do it crisscross you go around and then you kind of go sideways just to make sure that you cover all the areas also frost seeding you can roughly do about half the recommended rate uh, of, an, of a new plot so just say if it calls for about 10 pounds per acre uh, on a new plot for clover we can do five pounds something like that but we think we actually have about five pounds of clover and then five pounds of or three pounds of chicory we're gonna mix all together we're gonna go around a plot and we're gonna start out with the smallest opening go around once and then we can go around the other way just to make sure we have enough seed to cover all the area Show you guys what you have here you can see it's it's pretty much thawed right now when this morning this was rock solid so it's a perfect time you can see a little clover seed there and here chicory seed but yeah it's it's nice and soft now tonight it'll refreeze over the next couple days and then we'll get some rain that'll help as well then it'll freeze this will happen for over the next few weeks several weeks actually and then uh you know, things will start germinating. All right guys, it's clover field frost seeded with chicory and clover. Awesome uh, thing to do for you guys. If you guys have never done it, if you have an existing clover field, get out there, frost seed, look at your uh, temperature forecast over the next 10 days or so, and that'll give you a good judge on when you can frost seed. But get out there, frost seed, have some fun with it. Hope you guys enjoyed, smash the thumbs up button. If you guys are new, subscribe. Comment down below if you guys have any questions. Until next time, guys, I'll see you.